only on Christ 17 TV do you get daily picks, baby. Daily picks. Daily picks. Playoff time. Daily picks. Well, I had a pretty cool day. But let's recap the day. I had a four-team parlay. $30 wins me 406 I had the Nuggets in game one to cover six. They pushed. I had the Heat plus eight and a half. They covered and they won the game. I had the Yankees first first five innings, money line plus 160. They won. I had the Kraken under in game seven, under six goals. That was hit. So with the push, it turned my my four teamer to a three teamer. So the thirty dollars won me two forty two. On my straight, I had the Kraken money line plus one eighty in game seven. They fell short in game seven. I lost a hundred dollars to win one eighty on that one. My underdog was the Yankees plus one fifty money line. 100 won me 150 because the Yankees won. So, I won $272 on that day, and I was at 201 Wait a second. No, I won $292. My bad. $292, and I was at minus 201 So now I'm back positive at 91 Today's parlay, I got the Nuggets. Four and a half, minus 120. I got the Yankees, money line, plus 120. And I got the Carolina Hurricanes in game one of the conference finals, puck line, plus 180. So $50 wins me 500. And for my straight pick for today, I got the Nuggets. First half, minus three, 61, wins me 55. And for the underdog pick of the day, I got the St. Louis Cardinals with Adam Wainwright to beat the Dodgers. Money line plus 140. 45 wins me $63, baby. And I like all these picks for the day. Very confident. I'm on a roll. I'm about to come up. And the money tree fifth finna grow. You already know. Somebody talking about me. So, like I do always about this time, I do not promote gambling. I do not condone gambling. So if you're putting in bets and you're losing your bets and you can't, you know, and you in a big hole, don't blame Christ 17 TV. I didn't put the blicky to your head and make you type in your password Pick the parlays for you. Take the crazy bets. I didn't do that. That wasn't me. So so if you have Foot Locker trying on shoes, running out the store with the pair on to go sell them, to try to cut down your debt with the bookie, you might have a problem. You might want to call the 1-800 number. If you shoplifting, if you at the motherfucking Macy's, stealing clothes, stealing cologne, Trying to boost the shit and sell the shit at the flea market to try to come back up because you owe the bookie and you've been ducking him because he's about to bust your ass. Call the 1 800 number. It's not Christ 17's fault. If you see a girl walking with one of them expensive little dogs and you snatch the motherfucking dog and run and try to sell the motherfucker, you got a damn problem. Call the 1 800 number. It's not Christ 17's fault that you out here robbing. Women for little dogs. Trying to flip it because the, because the bookie's looking for you and he might bust your ass or pistol whip your ass because you way, way, way out there in debt and you ain't even tapped in and checked in and told him you was going to make no payments. You just ducking and dodging. You got a damn problem. Call the 1 800 number because they're going to bust your ass or maybe smoke your ass. So please, don't blame Christ 17 because I didn't get your ass bust. God bless and good luck. Let's go Yankees, let's go Nuggets.